Hey guys, Mike Cole back. Um, this is a Reebok Kamikaze video. Um, anyone that watched my videos before know how much I wanted a pair of these. Um, it took a while to come from America to come out in England. Um, I got these in July. Um, they did release in two stores I think in England. And I was very happy to get a pair. And then since these came out, We've had nothing, absolutely nothing kamikaze related, which is just shit. Um, so, got fed up of waiting. I did get in touch with Reebok and um, they got back to me saying there will be some more in December. That's actually true. We have two more two more pairs. Wow, considering you've got about 12 different colorways in America. And um, we've now got a total of three. Um, but I too late for me. I was fed up of waiting. So this video is for my friend Mario, big Reebok fan, and uh, yeah, he wanted uh, to me to show me my Reebok Kamikaze. So I imported these from America: the grey and blue feather, the white midsole. See the dirt, <laughs> they have been worn. Yeah, that's better. Yeah, so uh, there's the grey and blue feather, dude. Teal inside, it looks a bit blue, it's very teal. Um, there's the front view, so two very different colourways. You just saw this colourway as I was... Actually, no, I'm not going to do that one. As I was panning the camera around. I got the San Francisco Giants. Giants, yeah. Dubstep Slap will correct me on that. If he still watches. I'm not sure if he does still watch my videos. He's got a lot of subscribers now. All got suede toe boxes, which is nice. Short, short suede, maybe a new book. But it's nice and soft. The white leather zigzags. Again, the bin worn. These have become like a go to pair of shoes for me. So comfy that I think, oh, what shall I wear today? Sap on a pair of Cam and Cars's. They're just, yeah, they're top. So, yeah. This is the pair that Mario wanted to see the most because it's just come out in England. These are the black and royal blue. The thing I like about these is the honeycomb. Oh, I love the colourway. The royal blue is really nice. Um, but the honeycomb actually is a honeycomb. It's clear in the middle with the black outline. But with most of these, it's a solid pattern. You see that's actually just really kind of solid black. Um, a solid blue, and solid grey. So yeah, they're all quite solid colourways. But this, you can actually see the honeycomb way better. It's really nice. The hexalite, as it is, but I like the honeycomb. <laughs> That's the inside. These ones are dead stock. I haven't worn these yet. Um, I'm saving them. Obviously, I've got plenty of other choice. Um, the insides are white, maybe light grey. I can't even see myself. Yeah, light grey on the inside and white on the out on the midsole. Lovely, lovely toe box. Nice and soft. Honestly, Mario, you should uh, get on these, dude. You won't be disappointed. These are probably my favourite colourway of the lot. But having said that, I like all of them. So, picking a favourite, it's nice that I don't have to. So, and the final pair, which are actually a custom pair that I bought. Got them cheap. Which, you know, helped. As you can see. <laughs> 
nice pink insides, but at the bottom, orange. These are actually, these are the same pair as the San Francisco Giants, but the guy has painted all the white leather in black. He painted the back of the tongue in pink and all the insides in pink. Um, yeah, as you can see, he did a really good job, except here on the back of the tongue. That's the only downside. Did go over the label massively. Not too bothered though. I quite like it. I mean, you don't really see that when you've got your jeans on. And it's a you know nice all black and white pair of uh, cami glasses, which in another colourway we didn't get over here. So yeah. I say these for last because I'm expecting a lot of people to kind of hate on them and, and diss them. But, you know, they were cheap and well, they've been worn. They're going to get rocked hard. These can be my beta pair of cami cars. These when I, you know, if it rains or whatever, slap them on. The rest I'll keep as mint as I can. Anything that will get dirty is the bottom. So there you go. That's my cami cars collection. Um, I still want the steel grey and challenge red, danger red, I don't know, but the silver and red ones basically, silver, red and black, I still want them. If anyone's got a pair, wants to let go for retail, um, you know, let me know. I'm not looking more, paying more than retail for any of these, which I very much got lucky. Retail plus shipping, which is like 40 to $50 dollars to England, which is a bit shit, but it happens. There you go, Kamikaze collection. You can see behind them, Nike ID. You can see at the top, there's my third Nike ID that came in today. I'll be doing a review of them soon. Yeah, let me know what you think, guys. Um, big shout out to all my boys. Here's Yam, Dan, Ben, Abs, Ronald, KB, Morgan. Sneak Freaker 83, James, fan guy. I met him a couple of times now. Um, yeah, I can't remember who I've said, so I'm going to miss somebody out. And that's it, Youssef. Um, oh, fuck, should have wrote this down because my brain's gone funny. Anywho, right, I'll put you all your names in the bit down here. All my, all my sneaker homies in the UK. So, uh, yeah, man. Thanks for watching, and let me know if you Oh, one little thing about these. People keep saying the patent leather. Too cheap for patent leather. It's plastic. Translucent plastic. You can see through here where the leather comes underneath it. And it's the same on all of them. It's got a weird cut on it. Hmm. Yeah, they all cut different. Let's notice that. Not thick. I ah, can see it well on that one, but you see that where the leather comes under. Plastic toe boxes, not patent leather, not on one of them. So uh, yeah, you can see, see the leather coming under, and uh, there. So there you go. Yeah, just a bit of knowledge. So anyway, gone long. Thanks for watching. Bye.